this conference, and I know uh, the chair has mentioned two other things apart from what I have mentioned, the issue of making county assemblies truly independent and financially so. Um, I think that is an aspiration and that is um, a concept that I share and we will work with the necessary stakeholders and institutions to make sure that the Senate provides the framework for the independence of our county assemblies so that they can have their independent votes. Um, I know a matter has been also raised about uh, salaries and allowances. Uh, that is a very difficult one, I must admit, <laughs> because um, the balance is between increasing the salaries of those of us who have jobs or creating opportunities for the four or five million who do not have a job. That is the conversation we, we must have. So it is quite a balance, you, are, you agree. So, apo tuta iko kizungumkuti kidogo na tuta ongea. What I want to promise you is that we are going to work with all the institutions because I have given, I have requested SRC to give us a proper advisory on the matters of salaries and wages. It is a subject that, as a country, we must confront. Um, we must know that from the president to the uh, 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 assistant uh, uh, at the office, we all work for the people of Kenya. We live in the same country. We take our kids to school, we provide for their upkeep, provide for their food, we pay the hospital bills, all of us. And therefore, pay must reflect the fact that we all serve the same people. And we have come to discover, for example, that there are people who have awarded themselves salaries people in some parastatals, people in some other institutions who earn more than the president. And you ask yourself, what is this job this fellow is doing? <laughs> that is so, you know, so, so there, 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 there is a conversation we are going to have. So I want to tell my county uh, members, of, uh, members of county assembly, that is a conversation we are going to have and you are going to be treated the same way members of parliament who are serving in the legislature will be treated. I further commend the organizers of this meeting for clarity of purpose with which they develop the headlines and the themes therein. It is time for us as a country to shift 